we have made the decision that the 2014-15 academic year will be our final year of competition in football. It was, it was so emotional. It was so emotional going out there in the locker room before the game, man. You, you kind of looking around and you, and you think back. You putting on your helmet and shoulder pads, and you're like, man, like I'm, you're looking at the guy next to you, like, you know, this could really be our last go around. You know, and you know, for some guys who don't have the opportunity to, like I did, you know, so forced me to find another home. You know, those guys who kind of that was really their last time putting on pads. It was emotional, man. It was, that's probably one night I'll probably never forget. Most teams, I don't think most teams get that close, you know what I'm saying, outside of football. And we were, we were forced to have to deal with something that was bigger than ourselves, you know, bigger than football, bigger than even school. You know, you got guys who, that was pretty much it. You know, you got guys that, that just lost the passion for the game. That just, you know, some guys just didn't even want to go to school anymore. And then you kind of, and you know, outside of football, when you when you talk to those guys one-on-one, -on -one, you may, you might know that guy's not going back home, you know what I'm saying, to a good situation. So it was, it definitely, it definitely was, you know what I'm saying, made us a, a, a brotherhood, a, a bond that, you know, that we'll probably have for the rest of our lives. It really allows you just to think about, you know, the, the team or just, you, you realize everything is kind of bigger than you. When there's so much change going around, you don't really have time to be like me, me, me. You know, it's kind of, you just kind of gotta, I guess you would go with the flow, but like I said, it would, it kind of thing, it really just, it kind of humbled me, you know, and, and it and allowed me to realize that, that nothing, nothing is, is uh, or everything is temporary. The decision made after that final game left nearly 90 players without a place to play in the fall, including then junior wide receiver Darius Powell. Uh, pretty simple. Hey, come play over here. I want you. <laughs> I got a home for you. Don't sweat no bullets. Uh, let's roll, baby. And yeah, that's about what. It, that's about how it went down. I already knew Coach Williams. Um, it's one thing they really harped on was family, 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 and I really felt that when I came here. It was. It was definitely something I really felt like I couldn't pass up on. Uh, I met Coach Williams when I was 12 years old. He, um, like I said, when I was in uh, junior high, I, he actually coached me in a. Um, in the All-Star game down in Mobile, and I was one of the guys that was selected, and he coached he coached that, that our team for that game, and um, I got to play for him um, in that game throughout my high school career. And I mean, you, I don't know too many guys, if anyone has been able to say they played for the same coach through junior high, high school, and college. So that's definitely, um, I think it's definitely a blessing in disguise. The guys here, you know, it's felt like I've known these guys my whole life, you know, already. I've only been here for a few months. And, um, you know, I've, I've already built relationships with guys who I can tell we're going to be friends for a long time. I knew what we were getting. And I kept selling him to the other coaches and everything. Some of our coaches said, well, he's a little small. He's a little... I said, just get him here. And so we take him. And then within about a week or so while he was here, all the staff is going, you know what? Darius Powell may be the very best transfer player we got this year. I mean, he, he, he doesn't slow down. Although the UAB football program has been broken apart with players spread throughout the country, Powell remains close with his former teammates. That's pretty much something that I feel like I play for. I play for those guys who, who didn't get a chance to, you know what I'm saying, to continue their career. Um, I play for those guys who, who who were there, you know, when I when I was going through a tough time through early in my career and I was like, man, I don't I don't know, this is for me, you know what I'm saying? Those guys were there like, hey, like, you know, stick it out. And it if it weren't for these guys, I wouldn't be where I am today. I have the um free UAB. Um I think this one is this one is a, it's the UAB band that says God has this. I I wore it pretty much throughout the season, so it's pretty worn down. But uh It'll definitely be something I always carry with me. 